video, we talked to you about the new Serie A schedule and the innovation that has been implemented. What's up everybody? I'm Marco Messina. And I'm Michael Cantaros. And welcome back to Italian Football TV. The Serie A schedule, we've heard many rumors about what dates it will kick off, what breaks there will be that we'll have in the next year's season, but the official reports are out, and I gotta say, I'm pretty happy about what's gonna happen. Oh, for sure. They're definitely taking this a step up, taking a little bit of the Premier League uh, schedule over here, but it's good. That's what I feel like all the viewers want to see, and uh, enough with those breaks. We want to see as much culture as we as we could, right? We, we spoke to you guys about, if you saw our previous video about this, uh, that the Serie A is going to be kicking off at different times, trying to get the ma maximum viewership across all of the globe. Um, and it's very smart, and now they've announced their schedule, which does try to help that. Uh, the Serie A will kick off August 20th, same kickoff time as last year. Uh, it will finish May 20th, which is a week earlier than this year. Uh, schedule ending and Ventura did ask for more they, he wanted the Serie A schedule to be cut shorter so that he has more time to prepare for the World Cup in 2018 um, the Coppa Italia final May 9th uh, will be it will be much earlier so there's no confusion with the Champions League because we know that it's going to be Juventus and uh, Roma in the Champions League final so we don't want to have any confusion with the Champions League. Maybe, maybe, maybe not play maybe not play uh, anyway Jokes aside, uh, there's the big thing, the big, big, big thing that we're both excited about, the innovation comes with no winter break being included in the Serie A season. We heard rumors about this, many rumors that Italy was gonna have its Boxing Day, which means they don't go on break for Christmas. Um, last year, there's usually a break December 22nd where the players will go on holiday for a week or for a few days, but now they're gonna play through it there's no break December 22nd, no break for Christmas. There's only going to be a break uh, mid-January, like January 14th, 15th. There's going to be like a week break. This is kind of, it's a little tough on the players because, you know, it's more strict. They're paid millions and millions and millions of say, dollars. Yeah, they exactly. can play through Christmas. It's fine. I know. I was just about to say that. At the end of the day, it's better for everyone because they're going to get them more. Serie A can get more money and even the players can get more money. Yeah. The clubs can get more money. So you can't really complain about this. The Serie A, you have to be different if... I know this is copying the Premier League, but you need to do things that are better and bigger to try to get your name out there. Whatever it is, Serie A is not in a great moment. You do these little things, maybe pe more people watch, you get more viewership, everything increases. I think it's just a smart move. And as two diehard Serie A fans, it's just more content for us, more times to watch the league at a great time during holiday season. Us in America, we're very used to this with NBA, um, yes, football, NBA NFL, football. NFL. I don't know. I don't know which all, ones all it is, stuff. but they are. They play on Christmas Day even. Um, and the Serie A season will kick off August 13th. Juventus first Lazio for the Super Coppa. But again, the big news is that no winter break playing through December, no Christmas break. So very, very, very excited about for that. Time, um, hopefully you guys are too. I'm sure there's gonna be some opposite opinions saying that they shouldn't be playing. So let us know your side of the story. Do you agree with us? Do you think they should keep playing through the winter break? Or do you think that it's time to enjoy time with the family, enjoy holidays, and they shouldn't be playing? Let us know and we'll talk to you soon. Ciao, Ciao ragazzi. Guys.